Welcome back, everybody. Hope you were able to stay dry this weekend. We do still have some scattered showers moving through the area near Bangor as we have a much more massive uh, system, as you can see, over here to our southwest that'll be coming in by around Tuesday. Now we'll talk about the temperatures we had out there today. It was pretty hot out there. Bangor sitting around 78 degrees, a little cooler up north near Clayton Lake around 75, and we did have some 80s down to the southwest, as you can see near Sanford, or Sanford and Freiburg as well. Going into tomorrow, the lows are, are going into tonight. The lows are going to be pretty chilly. Bangor around 48 degrees and much of the area seems to be hanging in the upper 40s and the low to mid 50s. It will actually be a little bit warmer up north near Clayton Lake at around 50 degrees. Tomorrow, though, we're going to see that the temperatures are going to be sticking around the mid to upper 70s for most of the area, even some low 70s, and it will be a lot cooler down by the coast. You can see Deer Isle sitting around 60 degrees. It'll be quite cool down there in Portland at 63 as well. For the temperature trend throughout the rest of the week, it's going to cool off a little bit Tuesday, but Monday is going to be the day where we'll see a high of 81, and then we'll go into the rest of the week. We'll be in the low 70s before we cool off a little bit on Saturday again or near 68. But for tomorrow, it's going to be pretty hot out there, which means that the UV is going to be high as well. We'll have a 7 for the UV forecast, which means the burn time will be 30 minutes. So make sure you have your hat, sunglasses, sunscreen, and find some shade if you're out and about tomorrow. For the muggy meter, it's going to be pretty muggy throughout the rest of the week. It's going to go up and down uh, as we go throughout the week. We can see that the highest we'll probably get will be either tomorrow, Wednesday, or Thursday. And then we'll take some dips, but that looks like those will be during the overnight hours. So during the day, it will be a little muggy for us out there, but it should be nothing to worry about too much. For the future forecast, we still have some lingering showers in the area, but most of that rain is going to come from that massive system that we saw. It will be uh, coming in around Tuesday morning. That will be much more widespread rain that we'll see and some heavier rainfall as well. For the wind speeds in our area, it's pretty calm out there for central and northern Maine. We just see around uh, three miles per hour near Bangor coming from the west, and maybe uh, we could see six miles per hour from the northwest near Frenchville. But much of more of the breezy winds are coming from the coast. You can see by Rockland, uh, there's a south, or, yeah, southwestern wind around 12 miles per hour, so it's a little breezy down there by the coast. For tonight's forecast, the low will be 53 degrees and we'll have some showers early. It looks like they'll come in before 9 p.m. before things seem to clear out tonight and the winds will stay calm. For tomorrow, it's going to be a beautiful day, high of 81. It'll be partly sunny out there and the winds will be coming from the south at around 5 to 10 miles per hour. And for your extended forecast, we're going to see Tuesday and Wednesday is when we'll start to see some more rain, unfortunately. And we may have some isolated thunderstorms continuing, continuing into Thursday and Friday as well.